to record that again. <laughs> okay, we'll go again. Good morning, iFarm, and welcome to today's vlog. You are joining us this morning. An hour, and are you laughing at how I said it now, Isabel? <laughs> They're taking the mic because they say that I start the vlog in the same tone every day. <laughs> so I decided to play it a bit different, and they told me to record it again. Obviously, you just saw both. Anyway, you're joining us about an hour and 20 minutes from our home this morning at Manchester Airport. We just got to our meet and greet parking location near Terminal 1, and we're just unloading the car. Chris and Isabel are literally taking the mic out, and it's so bad right now. Just... Yes, you are. They're literally sat whispering. I can hear what you... They're sat <laughs> going, what, what? You think you can do a better job? Start the vlog, say good morning. Morning. <laughs> Go on then, give it your best shot. What's up, man? Oh dear. I think everyone will agree mine were better. Right, we're just about to unload the car, get everything together, go and get ourselves brag dropped and check in, and hopefully get ourselves a coffee because I need one. We've been up since about 6 a.m. this morning. I didn't sleep at all last night. Jace just didn't have a great night. It was one of those nights hold where. Up, was... Hold up, hold up, hold up. Wait, let me just get some out of my suitcase. This big violin here. Oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't sleep. <laughs> See you when we check in, guys. Good morning, gorgeous. Bye. Hello. Are you okay? Hello. Yeah, you Hello. good, man. You a bit. You like what's going on this morning? I woke up and I'm in somewhere weird. I'm in an airport. I'm not in my bed. Oh, oh you're so sweet, darling. Oh. You've been such a good boy today. You've been sleeping like a good boy. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Goodbye. <laughs> She weighs and we didn't get chance yesterday to go and have him weighed. Yesterday was only the first day obviously from our travels and it was closed, the local weighing place. So he weighs 6.2 kilograms so I'm just waiting for signal now to see how much that is in pounds. Pretty sure you're not meant to do them on them cases, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> Chicken man. Chicken chicken man. Do in that you can. Is your big sister being a really good big sister right now? <laughs> He's so cute. Look at me. Jace. Jace. Sometimes you know your name. <laughs> like, sometimes just wants to ignore you. I'm here. Hello, little man. If anybody can guess in the comments right now where we might be going from this board, don't be cheating and skipping forward in this video right now. You've got to comment it right now. Where are we going? You've run the chance of winning there, legendary status. Is it on there? Oh, it's on I there. think I've seen it. Wait. It's on there, mate. Definitely oh, I've seen it. I've so seen you feel it. like, guys, that's a good prize. Like you run the chance of winning <gasps> legendary status. If you guess right, where we might be going. Don't be cheating, though, because I'll know. Sarah's just currently having a head turn by all the perfume sales ladies, so we're just kind of waiting for it to get back right now. So we're just in departures, and we just found out that our flight's two hours delayed because the plane is tech in Paris at the minute. So tech, tech means broke. So. There's nothing really else for it, but a good old excuse to get a chai latte. <laughs> so we just walked into departures, like I said, and as we were coming in, there was this dude who was kicking off at one of the staff about the fact that his plane was delayed, and she was like, I'm really sorry, it's now a two hour delay, and I thought, oh, that's not good, poor guy. Then I walked around the corner and saw the board. Turns out. Turns out it's our flight that's delayed in two hours. <laughs> oh, great. <laughs> So apparently our plane is currently broken in Paris somewhere that we're waiting for. So it's still got to be fixed to come back here, pick us up and then take us. So, you know, perfect time for a few of these maybe. 
Gotta look at the bright side of every every bad situation. And now we got a chai and I got a cold latte. I've got a chai and she got an iced latte and the girls are chilling out happy as Larry with their cold drinks they've got and uh, we're well, just reading books. Yeah, yeah, we're just sitting chilling now in the airport. We're still not telling you where we're going just yet. We're waiting to surprise you when we get there. Such a bad I, I always like that's so tight, but then I realise it'll be like two seconds worth. Ain't got long to wait guys, it's all good. Isabel just noticed that there's an airline called SAS. I know, it's fucking at it. It's spelled the right way because I think it's called double S. It's actually SAS, but it's, you know, it's almost there. Oh, but yeah. <laughs> we have finally just boarded and hopefully okay, we'll be setting up. this one here oh this is like the boiler and things and then this one laying here is it's the last one must be yes. <laughs> yay the big one. oh my gosh big tv on the wall oh, nice one, man. That's, all. that's so cool 
It looks so awesome! Oh, this place is amazing! There's a pigeon like right there. Wow, this place is so nice! I love this. Yo guys, gotta say, this place is beautiful! Look at those tree and greenage. Little home right there. Greenage all around. Love it! Beautiful. Anyway, after a little chiller, we've had a bit of an hour's relax in the cabin, which was extremely nice. Oh, was the so girls nice. have been the it's bestest of friends yeah. ever. Jason's had a sleep and he's feeling much better and less cranky. So we're gonna have a wander, go find out what this place is about, and then we're gonna get some dinner, hopefully. I'm actually really hungry. I'm so hungry, I can't deal. I was going to say, the only thing I've eaten today is the, a little sandwich that we had in the airport. One, the worst thing about your flight being delayed is you eat munch in the airport. Is how much it costs <laughs> because you end up eating food. And then you have a wander into WH Smith's and find a book that takes your eye. In fact, Isabel's been after a book, a new book, yeah. for a while now. She saw one of her friends reading it and I've managed to find it in WH Smith's. So I bought her it as a surprise and she's well chuffed, aren't you? Yeah. What's the book? What book is it? Um, it's called, uh, oh, I'm sure I you remember. Mean. It's like um, a girl's plot to murder or something, a girl's guide to murder. I'll, well, I'll show you later on we'll when we get back. We'll show you I don't think it's as brutal as that a title, but no, it's, it's, it's sort trial. of like that. No, it's no, no it's, I know it's, it's for, a, I know it's a teen book. It is. But it's like, it's I'm sure like, it didn't say like, murder in it. Did, what did it, it say? Yeah, it did. It says something guide to murder. It's about someone who got murdered or something. It is a teen story though. Yeah, it's not like really graphic or really like reading anything. It's just like, oh, and chill. Oh, and chill. Yeah. Chill. Come okay, on. Chill. Yeah. I better read this book first just to make sure it's suitable. Okay. Oh, OMG. What's the part of that? OMG, guys, what? <gasps> Time to reveal where we are. No, Ooh. that's later in the vlog, Alan. Not right now. Let's go. <laughs> Anyways guys, now is your last chance to comment below what country you think we flew to today and don't be cheating by skipping forward in this video or trying to skip to the next video. Wait, no, that one's not been made yet. But don't be trying to cheat <laughs> because if you try and cheat then you won't be a hero or a legend and if you do get it right then every one of you will earn the chance to be a legend in my eyes. So comment below now which country are we in? supermarket that's here and then we nipped to the restaurant it's one of those places where if you're single it's probably good there's loads of different cooking stations but if you're a family it's a bit of a nightmare because everybody wants different and that means nobody gets to eat at the same time but it's all good so we're all sharing anyway so me and Isabel went for a vegetable mushroomy noodle type thing this white stuff here that you can see is mayonnaise because well oh um, GBDs. Oh, it's spicy. We were like, Mum, well, I said to Mum, oh, this one looks pretty good. Should we get it? And I was, I was like, wait, it won't be spicy. It won't be spicy. And Mum was like, no, no, it's not spicy. Like, loads of people are getting it, so it's probably not spicy. I sit down, because obviously most people get the other meals, and I'm like, oh, mate, no. Mum, you have to go back and get some mayo because this is just unbearable mayo. <laughs> to be honest, so spicy. Chris tasted it, Anna's and been tasting it, and they both said it's not spicy, so I think it might just be mean as Bob and Wussies. Yeah. But it's either way, spicy. it's quite spicy, but it is it's absolutely delicious. delicious. So yeah. flavoursome and nice. And Isla and Esme both went for. It's still. It's like a soup broth. It was like a watery with celery and leeks. Chicken. Chickeny soup and broth. And you've eaten that all up before we'd even sat down. And Remember, if, I mean, if I have stuff from my eyes, it's just because I've had everything my You have, Isabel, we've been sharing our noodles. Yeah. But it was pretty good, quite delicious, and we've all enjoyed it. We just got back to our beautiful cabin after a nice long stroll back from the canteen restaurant area. <laughs> we just got back here and we are about to have a cup of tea and watch some TV, which is something I feel like we've not done in so, so, so long. I'm about to tell you guys where we are, but just before I do, I just wanted to say that this place we're at has so much to offer there's so much going on we've already been super duper impressed and we haven't even seen the mega water park that's here and theme park oh we're really really excited to go and check it all out tomorrow but i was just saying also on the way back that i'm really looking forward this week to taking easy a little bit 
which probably sounds crazy after we've just been like chilling in our caravan for the last month but we didn't actually get a chance to just sit down and do nothing we felt like i felt like was always on the go even though some days it was just at the beach or at the pool we never really just got to relax and do nothing where do you want to go tomorrow girls water park theme park or water park water park, park. Theme park. Theme park. Water park. Okay, we'll decide tomorrow anyway, but if you haven't already guessed, then we are in... Lapland! Are we not? <laughs> we are in Amsterdam! We're in Amsterdam! <laughs> and we're very excited, we're at a place called, pronounce it Isabel, down roll. Down roll. We're really bad because we can't fully pronounce it. The guy at the um yeah the passport control. Passport wait, control. Yeah. He said we were like, oh, we're saying it down. Down roll. Down roll. And he goes down roll park. Downtown. This is where we're staying and it's so awesome. It's kind of part of a Euro camp. There's lots of Euro camp cottages here with the Euro camp logo on. There's also massive pitches for tents. There's loads of caravans which takes us back to our road trip that we've just got back from which is awesome. There's loads of different style cottages and we're currently in one of the cottages. One of the dungalows they're called. Not bungalow. Dungalo. It's amazing and we're so excited to be here and to spend the week making memories as a family. It's going to be an epic week for sure. But thank you guys so much for watching this video. We hope you're looking forward to a week full of adventure um, starting tomorrow at 5pm. So we'll see you back here. Good night!